All the picks are in and you can review all the Ravens draft results with the Press Box Draft Report presented by Royal Farms at PressBoxOnline.com. And welcome back to Inside Press Box. Earlier this week, an international advocacy group that ranks public access walkability announced that Baltimore ranked ninth in its survey of public transit nationwide. But that ranking is no surprise. A few weeks ago, the MTA demonstrated one way that it encourages excellence with the bus and maintenance rodeo. We're inspecting the uniform, making sure the operator had the proper uniform, tie, make sure they didn't have white socks, make sure their shoes were shined, make sure their badge was showing, make sure their shirts were tucked in. They, they check you out to make sure that you dress properly the way you're supposed to dress on a normal day. Make sure you have everything one you're supposed to have, your watch, your pens, your badge, proper uniform dressing. After the uniform inspection, the operator goes to a bus to do a pre-trip inspection of the vehicle. Now, they've planted at least 10 defects that the operator must find and write on the pre-trip inspection card. When you pull a bus out, you have to pre-trip the bus to make sure it's safe and adequate for your run and the people on the safety-wise when you're on the, on the street. It's a normal pre-trip that the bus is, you know, operator is supposed to do here with the MTA. Um, there are some defects on the buses that we have there just to make sure that they go over them. They're being judged by the defects and the points are being given or taken of what they got or didn't get. Okay, okay. All right. In the final stage of the, of, the, of the competition is when you do the driving, the course itself. You have like 10 different obstacles. You have seven minutes to perform with precision without any hitting the cones and stuff like that. First operator of the day. Let's give a big round of applause, ladies and gentlemen, for all great out of Northwest. A lot of the runs, like the run that I'm on now, I'm on the 97 line. It's a lot of turning, a lot of uh, driving precision-wise. You have to be able to handle that coach the way that you're supposed to handle it. And they set the cones up. I don't know where they get that idea from, but they've been doing it for years, and it's, it's good. It's, it's very good help a lot. Whoever scores the most, all the uniform, pre-trip inspection, skills on the course, will wind up being the grand prize winner of a all-expense trip paid to the internationals to compete with other operators of transit systems around the country. Last year was great. I won it. I went to Memphis, Tennessee, uh, uh, competing against the other guys from the rest of the country. It was really nice. It was 144 guys. I came in like 18 for somewhere around there. Did pretty good, uh, con considering my first time. It would be nice if the rest of the guys kind of like messed up a little bit so I could go to California this year, but. I hope the best for them all, you know what I mean? All right, I could never do that with a bus. I can barely do it with my Prius. Congratulations to this year's winners of the bus rodeo operator, Benny Williams, who just left on Wednesday for California, where he'll compete for national recognition. We'll wrap things up after the break, so don't go away. Inside Press Box is presented by Friedmont Mortgage. Don't make a 30-year mistake by choosing the wrong lender. Go to Friedmont.com now for all of your mortgage needs.